Vice Chair of the Commission on Immigrant Affairs. I want to take this opportunity to thank, welcome us for having convened National Immigrant Heritage Month nationwide. I'm very excited to stand here before you today with Mayor Pro Tem Cheryl Cole, Ben Ramirez, Rob Avrush, and Carlos Estrada to celebrate the immense importance the role of immigrants have played in not only these United States, but in our great city of Austin. Before that, a slight segue. I don't know about you, but I'm an avid soccer fan. <laughs> so, my question is, how many of you have been following the World Cup? <laughs> Great. So, now, Tim Howard, Josie Altidore, Jermaine Jones, Fabian Johnson, Omar Gonzalez, Alejandro Bedoya, Mix Discrand, Aaron Johansson, Timmy Chandler, Julian Green, John Brooks. Do you know one thing these individuals have in common besides representing the United States on the World Cup team? Exactly, their immigrant heritage. Truth be told, the United States could feel an entire starting lineup of players who are foreign born or first generation immigrants. Regardless of where we fall in generational terms, to quote President Franklin Delano Roosevelt, remember, remember always that all of us, and you and I especially, are descended from immigrants and revolutionaries. Immigration has always been and will continue to be an important part of the United States' strength in an increasingly globalized world. In fact, According to the New America Report by the Pew Research Center, immigrants will make up a combined 37% of the population by 2050, exceeding the 20th century high of 35%. In Austin, we are more than halfway there, with 19% of our residents being foreign-born. From the wealth of cultures, traditions, and peoples that make up the fabric of our city, we derive a unique perspective of ourselves, our communities, and the world. Through the exchange of information and knowledge, we become better versions of who we are. We foment growth and innovation. We find new and inclusive ways to lead. Thank you to Mayor Leffingwell and the City Council for having recognized this, not only by proclaiming June Immigrant Heritage Month, but by having declared Austin a welcoming city and taking the steps to make this a reality as well. Thank you for joining us in this celebration, a celebration of us. I hope you enjoy your evening, and I'd like to introduce Carlos Estrada. Thank you. Wow.